We're Team Vextus. Our project is based around the idea that in a city, if you're living in an apartment, it can be really difficult to have the time or space to grow fresh veggies and enjoy them. And so we built an indoor automated greenhouse that allows these apartment dwellers to effortlessly grow fresh produce, such as leafy greens or herbs or root vegetables in their apartment from seed to harvestable size fully automatically. There are a lot of like, indoor growing systems, but what we decided to do differently was we decided to go with a soil-based system. So a lot of all the systems out there are hydroponics, which means that you cannot really grow anything with a deep root system, whereas here we can grow much more greater variety of vegetables and just plants in general. So like we're growing carrots and radishes right now, which you would not be able to do in a hydroponic system. We also have it completely automated so that the, we have a soil sensor and a moisture sensor that checks how wet the soil is and when it gets below a certain threshold, the system will automatically start watering. If the user feels for some reason that the system is not watering enough, then they can go in and choose to make it water uh, and any excess water will just percolate through into the water tank below, so we're going to recycle all the water that we can. So all the leftover water through the dirts would be filtered through these three system and then be pumped back up through the pump here and rain down again. Since the water will be circling through in, inside the system, you will only need to fill the water once uh, like in three weeks. Our client is HSB Living Lab um, in at Chalmers University in Gothenburg, Sweden, and they're a, it's an apartment building that also runs as a research facility. They run different experiments in different ways to live in an urban setting, more sustainably, um, more socially. Um, so we're building two more of these units and then shipping them all to Sweden and over the first week of June, um, installing all three of those units at the living lab so residents can use these to grow their own vegetables, cook with them, and kind of you know, experiment and test with them to see how best they can use them.